A virtual document is a collection of files that you can use to generate a large document. For example, you can create a virtual document for a book that starts with a front cover document and then add files as chapters. The book's front cover file virtual document is called a parent and the component files are called children. Each child can have different permissions for each group of users responsible for keeping it updated. This video will show you how to view, browse, and create simple virtual documents. Let's start by opening an existing virtual document by selecting Display Outline from the menu. The Virtual Document Outline allows you to browse virtual documents and change their structure using this tree view. The Properties pane shows the properties of each item, which you can edit. The Preview pane displays the contents of each item. You can drag and drop items in the tree view to change the order of the virtual document. Click back to return to the previous view. Let's create a virtual document. In the doc list, find the document you want to use as the parent. Position your pointer over the item and select Convert to Virtual Document. Add children to the virtual document by selecting the parent and clicking Add Child. You have four options for adding the child. Browse, to navigate through the repository for single or multiple files to add. Create, to create a new file using standard D2 creation profiles. Import, to upload new files from your computer. And from template, to create a new file from a defined virtual document template. We will browse for content already in the repository and select a user guide. Don't forget to save the changes to your virtual document by checking it back in. Thanks for watching.